If this is Gemini 3.0 Pro, then this is extremely good for programming. The new Gemini 3.0 Pro, which is kind of in rumors at this particular point, but Google employees have neither denied nor accepted that the model is going to come soon. But we have been seeing a lot of people sharing about the AB test where they have been exposed to Gemini 3.0 and the model is doing extremely well in zero shotting couple of prompts. And in this video, I wanted to highlight a few things that I just came across and it is quite stunning to be honest, like whether it is uh, trying to simulate the entire Windows operating system. This Twitter user had shared that for a very simple prompt, Gemini 3.0 Pro has completely zero shorted this windows uh, simulation so you can see here it is booting it's calling itself or os you have got a notepad you can edit and then you can do a bunch of things you can you have got games you can write you can do all those things and it is not just like windows operating system but it also is good at creating simulations like this right side that you have got here is gpt5 pro and the left hand side that you have got here is Gemini 3.0 Pro and you can see how good Gemini is with the simulations, the animations and the ease of it. The other interesting thing that we've been seeing online is that Gemini 3.0 Pro has uh, been particularly very good with creating SVGs. So this could be a model specifically trained for programming. So that could be the reason why the model has got a really good creative sense with the designing and also it does very good with designing SVGs. Like you can see here uh, for a comparison, this is what GPT-5 in auto mode without thinking explicitly enabled did it and it thought and then it created this. The person had tried to ask Gemini 3.0 to create an SVG of an Xbox controller and this is what it has created. Here is one more Twitter user using Gemini 3.0 Pro to create something called a neuromorphic design. I'm not sure what does it even mean but it wrote over 1600 lines and there was only one bug and this is the link of it. So you can see here it is running on code pen and the the vibe of the design itself is completely different i should say like every other ai designed website look like the gradient the pink or purple but here it you can see like the vibe is very designed it's almost like a framer design and uh, it's just like one html file as you can see here in the code pen it is a single html file and uh, gemini 3.0 pro like the user mentioned has created all these things the design is I would say honestly like stunning. I would not believe that this is something that one shot at like by Gemini 3.0. The final thing that I wanted to give is the most viral video of all, which is Gemini 3.0 one shotting or zero shotting, whatever you would like to call it a simple Mac OS system. So you can see here, it's got the Mac OS vibe here. You've got like Safari here and you can see it opens. Only thing is, I think if you click it, it doesn't necessarily show the Safari. So I can, uh, this is running on code pen. You can go see here. So you've got a finder. You can close the finder. You can open a browser. Um, it doesn't load anything other than Wikipedia as far as I know. And you've got a terminal and you can just go here and then say, who am I? And then it is going to say guest. I don't know if LS works. Okay. LS also works. MKDAR. I don't know if MKDAR would work. One LC. Okay, it doesn't work with MKDAR, but you can see it's got LS. Let's do CD desktop and yeah, CD also doesn't work. So most of the things uh, it's obviously it's simple HTML file, but you can see that it is doing a pretty good job of showing what it is. There is like a paint window and you can just go paint something. I can say one little, okay, little coder. Yep, yeah, it's doing a pretty good job. And just to give you a comparison, uh, I did the same prompt with Gemini 2.5 Pro and this is what I got. See, honestly, Gemini 2.5 Pro is also not bad. As you can see here, um, it has got the terminal and it has got the files. You can just go write whatever you want. Uh, I love Mr. Little Coder and uh, you have got the browser, uh, Explorer, you've got a simple browser, you've got settings. And in fact, it's got a music that I can just play. Uh, I've unmuted the tab. So you can, it's crazy, isn't it? Um, it's crazy to the fact that uh, this is 2.5 Pro and like everybody's raving about 3.0 Pro. And uh, I am pretty sure 3.0 Pro, if it is real, it is going to be stunning. But this also brings to the point where we don't necessarily explore the current model very well. And we are always seeking the next model. And uh, I, am, I am happy whenever there is a new model because I can make a new video. But I think as a community developers, we should focus on maximizing the juice that we can extract from the current model. But anyways, we're looking forward to Gemini 3.0 Pro. 
If you have got anything interesting, let me know in the comment section. Otherwise, see you in another video. Happy prompting.